Okay, so we've got a bit of a dramatic rescue on the River Thames at the moment. There's a narrow boat which has lost all power and the PLA, Port London Authority, are currently trying to anchor the boat. The problem is, is that the tide is going out, so as much as they try to uh, tow it upstream, westbound, the current is just taking it back. Um, other boats have had to uh, slow down, like this one leaving Canary Wharf. Uh, clippers are slowing down for it. We have uh, the Metropolitan Police boat, standby over there just warning other river users of this escalating situation so there seems to be about three or four people on the narrow boat never under underestimate the kind of power of the uh, current on the Thames it really is quite ferocious especially when it's on the tides that are kind of like coming in fast or going out fast. Slack tide, yeah, take one of these beauties out, but right now this is a challenge, especially for engine failure. This is a full scale uh, emergency. You've got there the skipper of the boat. Uh, I hope he's wearing a buoyancy aid. They're just trying to bring it upstream. I'm not sure where they're taking it, probably to Limehouse Marina. Um, but anywhere where there's no current, I think they've basically come from uh, somewhere down river and thought they could make it in a day and realized they've run into problems because of their turning current. And this is why understanding the river and its timetables of tides is so important. And, and crucial to your safety and, and going on the river. So Metropolitan Police is still there, Clippers are still there, there's other boats coming in aware of this situation. But still, they're not really gaining much ground. They did a, a tow uh, that was directly uh, PLA in front of the narrow boat, but it just wasn't pulling it along. So they've tried a new technique of mooring alongside it on the starboard uh, side, port side, sorry. And uh, they seem to be gaining further territory, but uh, not a place you want to be on uh, in terms of conditions now. They look like they're going into Limehouse Marina. They're starting to edge towards that. The uh, boat there, the police boat, is just at the entrance to Limehouse Marina. Uh, so hopefully they're going to try and steer it. That's what it looks like. The uh, pleasure cruiser there has slowed down. It's not all plain sailing. I certainly remember this entrance to London, that's for sure. But anyway, they are in safe hands. Thank you, PLA. Thanks, Met Police. Looking after these. slowly edging its way towards Limehouse Marina. That guy's pacing up and down. He's probably done a good 200 steps. I'm not sure what he's doing, pacing up and down. A little bit dangerous just to be doing that. I would stay, s I would, I would stay still, really. There's a lot of rocking on that boat. Wandering up and down again, it's uh, a surprise he's doing that. Just stay still until the last moment. The 
there's going to be a lot of turbulence as they go into Limehouse Marina here. And in they, in they go, with the City of London behind them. Fabulous work.